So one important idea in dealing with fractions is known as the concept of equivalent fractions. And what we have is we have two different divisions representing the same amount. And so, for example, I might have the division 3 fifths and I might have the fraction 9 fifteenths. And what I'd like to do is, if possible, to show that these two are equivalent. So I might begin by trying to represent 3 fifths. And so this is, I'm going to take a whole, divide it into five equal parts, and then shade three of those parts. So there's my whole, 3 fifths, three of those parts. Now what if I want to represent 9 fifteenths? So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take the whole, and rather than draw 15 vertical parts. And I'm going to do is I'm going to split this up a little bit. And I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I can divide something into 15 by first dividing it into five parts and then dividing it into three parts. So there's my division into fives, there's my division into threes, and so now I have 15 equal parts and I want to shade nine of those parts. And so there's my nine fifteenths. So here's three fifths. Here's 9 fifteenths, and the question is, I want to show that these two are equivalent. Well, there it is. I can look at the picture and see that 3 fifths, 9 fifteenths, represent exactly the same amount. 